I'm back with another video. Today I'm preparing fried tilapia fillets with some hot sauce as a dipping sauce. So let's get started. Start off by cleaning your fish to reduce any bacteria that may be on your tilapia. Next, we're gonna get our spices together so we can coat the outside of our fish. And I'll be using the following spices. Now you want to whisk these seasonings together. These few spices will help enhance the flavor of the fish. My tilapia is clean and the fillets have been cut in half. And the next step is to get the batter together. In a separate bowl, I'm going to add in my wet ingredients. Here I'm going to crack open two eggs. Then I'm going to pour in some hot sauce and yellow mustard. I'm going to whisk these ingredients until everything is well combined. And I'm going to set this bowl to the side. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media platforms, TikTok, Instagram, and of course, YouTube. Next, I'm going to combine my dry ingredients in the Ziploc bag. First, I'm going to pour in my all-purpose flour. Then I'm going to add my white cornmeal. Next, I'm going to pour in all of my Louisiana fish fry. And then I'm going to combine my blended seasonings. Next, I'm going to combine all my ingredients and set the Ziploc bag to the side. In the bowl of my fish fillets, I'm going to add in my wet ingredients and my combined seasonings and coat the outside of my fish. Now I have my Ziploc bag where I combined all of my dry ingredients. The next thing I'm going to do is take my fillets out of my bowl, drop them into the dry ingredients, and then place them into the hot oil. And I'm going to repeat the same process until all the fillets have been cooked. But with the thicker pieces, I'm only going to add in about four strips at a time. And depending on how thick your fillets are, we determine your cook time. So my fillets are going to be cooked five minutes on each side. And for the thinner fillet pieces, you can add in about six at a time and let it cook for about three to four minutes. And also, I want to let you know that I don't start my timer until the last fillet is dry.
If you like this video, please like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit your notification bell and share my channel with everybody in your contacts. Wait, wait, wait. Let's be more realistic. Just share my channel with at least one or two people. Bye.